Well, human beings are creatures who are constantly sucked back into violence. Our great mistake, in my view, is that we believe the solution to violence is more violence. Uh, and the uh, actions in Libya today are an example of that. Of course, the promised no-fly zone turns out to have been much more than that. It's an act of uh, profound uh, war-making. Whatever the outcome, in my view, a terrible mistake, a very familiar one, a mistake that is shaped by generations of institutionalized uh, acceptance or even celebration of violence as the solution to problems. Um, the reason you do history is to understand where this structure of the imagination came from. We are people, let's emphasize when I say we, Western civilization and, and, the, and the way in which it stands on the traumas of violence many, many centuries ago, the apocalyptic mind, which is captured most powerfully in the New Testament book of Revelation, also known as Apocalypse, believes that the way to salvation is through destruction. Mm -hmm. It's a religious idea. It captured something in the Western imagination. It's a catastrophic idea. The way to salvation is through destruction. What is that? Is secularism the answer? Well, secularism is as much a part of this imagination as religion is. Uh, because the 20th century, full of secular ideology, enacted this very dynamic. Enjoy Grit TV? Want more people to see it? Well, we are making our program available free to public television stations coast to coast. If you would like to see our show on your local public television station, please give them a call and ask for Grit TV with Laura Flanders. Thanks.